Hey guys, Quackenstein Monster here. And welcome back to the gaming experience of Mega Man X4, the X Run. Anyway, this is for the Sony PlayStation. And this video game playthrough is brought to you by GameAnyone.com, your number one source for video game walkthroughs. And the moment I've been dreading for quite some time is finally here. Uh, in the last part, we got through Magma Dragoon and Frost Walrus. But that, which leads me into the moment I've been dreading this entire video game playthrough. Jet Stingray. If you thought my freak out in the this guy stage was bad, oh no. <sighs> It's gonna be a lot worse. <laughs> oh, what makes things worse is I gotta do this again with zero. <laughs> I hate this stage. Uh, just to let you know, this video could just be this one stage alone. Uh, well, let's get cracking on it. Fuck me! <laughs> it's a douchebag! I hate this stage! Uh, okay, so as you can see, it's a jet bike section, and I'm not too fond of these whatsoever. Um, how it takes me a while, and it could take me multiple videos just to get through this goddamn stage, but we'll get through it eventually. Now we got a heart tank in this section here, which I just fucking missed, so. Death count one! <laughs> yeah, if you want to collect that, don't do what I did. Don't jump. But once we collect that, then we just got the whole process of beating this fucking part. However, should something occur that happened on my personal file, I'm taking it. I don't give a shit. God damn it. Death number two. Coming up. Uh, I hate these stages. We got another one of these damn things in X5! Alright, now don't jump. Don't fucking jump. Okay, I don't care. We got it. It's good. Good. Uh, we, got, we collected it. That means we don't need to worry about it anymore. All is good. Well, I gotta say, the second part really isn't the, that bad. This part's the worst. Okay, jump. Jump. See, it's no longer there. It was right underneath that platform. Oh, great. Here we go. Uh, damn it. Uh, wait a minute. Fuck! I was really hoping that glitch would have showed up there. Basically, I glitch beat this section. Due to the codes I had, it scrolled off me off stage without having me die. And it went straight into the state, uh, section 2 of this uh, God Accursed level. And that's how I got through it on my uh, legit file, or uh, not my legit, my own personal file, which I've already beaten. I beat it earlier today. And... There we go, we got through it. There. Wow. Um, that didn't take nearly as long as I thought. I thought I'd still be stuck on there. 
Now this stage has got something unique. Uh, in fact that we see the fucking boss right there. Now I gotta say I'm, I do enjoy the change of scenery. It's not that bad actually. No. No. Coming up, it's coming up. Alright, we got a sub tank coming up here. Jump up here. Got it on the first fucking shot, but I died. As you can see, this part's not all that bad, really. You know, I gotta say, I'm kind of thoroughly shocked just to prove that we got the damn thing. Here it is. <sighs> Since we got this done in a short amount of time, actually, which I'm very surprised. Um, what the fuck killed me that time? Uh, we might as well just get all the Mavericks done now. And collect everything, get ready for the final stages. This, help, this uh, project is not taking me all that long, actually. Fuck you, Jet Stingray. Fortunately, if he got his weakness, he's a fucking pussy. He can pretty much stunlock his ass and... Fuck you, Jet Stingray! What the fuck killed me that time? Okay, this is becoming bullshit. No, no. What the fuck? I jumped. I jumped. I jumped. I swear to God, I fucking jumped. What if? What if? Mm. Yeah, fuck you, Jet Stingray. Keep in mind that does nothing to help the in the boss fight, but uh, what it does do is get him off our ass. No. Okay. There we go. And I'm going to hit up the Frost Tower as that is his weakness. <sighs> Thankfully, the rest of the game won't be so bad. Just this stage. <sighs> I'm impressed that you found me. Yeah, I'm surprised I got here that as fast as I did, too. But your search is over. Get ready, X. <laughs> Fuck you, buddy. You're not my friend. God damn it, I always do that. There we go. And this is where the rest of the boss fight's gonna... Never mind. Quit contradicting me, asshole. Alright, that all goes well. This is where the rest of the boss fight will be. Just jump up and hit the motherfucker. If you don't miss on the first shot, you've got just enough frost tower to beat him. If you, if you decide to choose this as a starting stage, which I wouldn't fucking blame you. Get this piece of shit stage done and over with. Fuck you! G 
Yeah! Woo! Oh, now normally... Now, normally, I don't save it in the middle of a video. But just should things go wrong? And as much as I don't like this stage, as you see right there, my personal file, this used to be the file I was going with, but instead I matched up my personal file here, which this is what it was. Um, I'm turning slot, uh, the second save file into my personal one, so yeah. Continue! Alright, on to Slash Beast. And then we're gonna make a quick jaunt into a Magma Dragoon. He defends the military train to protect the supply of goods. Unfortunately, he's not gonna be doing that good of a job. Okay, as you see, we're moving along. We got these little grenadier bots here. Oh, the kamikaze grenadiers, I should say. What the fuck? Oh no. We got a little serv, a little mechs, little hard hats, bastards. Fine, take that. Fuck you. Get down here. Die from that fucker's laser. Let's move on. Now we got our little we got a little mini boss here. Let's go fuck him up. As you see, very easy with the route I take, but still, he's not too bad. Ready. Now, those blue boxes, I, there was no way in hell I could fucking destroy, but these... Fuck yeah. Now, there is another ride armor in here. You see those blue boxes there we can't destroy without a ride armor, but we're not taking those. I'm actually not even going to use a fucking ride armor. We'll fuck the enemies. Uh, ride armor's up. No problem. Fuck you. Yeah. Do you remember when I was in uh, Magma Dragoon stage? But there was one other uh, boss that I was aware of that you could use a right armor on. That was Bamboo Pandemonium. But anyway, we got our sub tank, or our heart tank to get here. And that is right on the top of a... It was right there, it's right on top of this. With the right armor, you could destroy this fucking train, but uh, really, why do that? So all we're gonna do is just take out the Guardian. Who is very weak. Get off my ass, asshole. Fuck you. Die. Fucking bastard. Okay, we're coming up to another section. We would have lost the right armor anyway, so... Get off my ass, douchebags. Fuck you. Fucking bats. Yeah, if you do things just right in the uh, bamboo pandemonium stage in X8, 
Uh, you can actually bring the right armor in to fight the motherfucker. But anyway, I'm gonna start bringing in the ground hunt hunter. Okay. Yeah, I'll take that. And here we are at the Maverick Hunter. Or, uh, not the Maverick Hunter, the Maverick himself. Say hello to Slash Beast right there. Challenging my unit was both foolish and reckless. You are nothing more than my prey. One that is soon to be retired. You know, in my eyes, that really was Mega Man saying that. As you see, got him stunlocked. And that was our friend Slash Beast. With that, we get the Twin Slasher. Which is what is needed in Magma Dragoon stage to get the armor piece. I just told the viewers that asshole, calm down. Shush. Alright, we're going to continue without saving. The Ripper Force has begun assembling. Where are they? The spaceport. They plan to take off into space. Hurry, we have to stop the Colonel. Yeah, we ain't going there yet, Mega Man. Just throw your ass down, bitch. We got a pit stop here in Magma Dragoon stage. Which the armor piece is in the second stage, so which is in the second stage part of this. So I'm gonna pause and we'll uh, pick it back up where we left off. Oh, uh, when I get there, so I'll see you there. Okay, I am back. And sorry about the little visual disruption I apologize but we're here now so anyway we just need that little thing just to boost us up now remember how I said the double slasher was how you get on here well, I'm using it on here and it's not working what you gotta do is just charge it up and BOOM and see we got our fourth and final uh, Dr. Light Capsule. Equipped with this new body module X. This body pod absorbs damage inflicted by enemies and will gradually accumulate within. When it is filled to capacity with the energy, you can execute the invincible Nova Strike. However, a single use will consume all your energy stores. So use it only to pull through tight situations. Yeah, whatever. I'm not going to be showing it off. Well, I might just this once. And here we go. Fully armored X. And there was the uh, Nova Strike. But anyway, that also brings us to the en end of this video. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Uh, stay tuned for uh, more Mega Man X4. I'll see you guys later. I am out, sadly.